This is not right. The um, and it told me to turn right, so I turn right, and this is the road it told me to turn right on. I'm not paying attention because I'm trying to book our harvest host for tonight. Otherwise, I would have been like, uh-uh, no stopping, you keep going. There's a, okay. Holy scary. What? Oh yeah, turn right. Okay. I'm pretty sure this is where they filmed The Hills Have Eyes. What is that thing? <laughs> that was ridiculous. That was actually kind of a shortcut. Here at oh boy. Sleeping Bear Dunes National Lakeshore. Um, we're trying to figure out how to access the bike trail from here. We had to pull off into an RV parking area because RVs can't go on the scenic route. <laughs> so you know what? We're gonna go ahead and bike the scenic route. Yeah. That's what we think about that. Again, win for full-time RVing because we didn't have to prepare anything. Everything's right there. We just pull off. Grab some extra layers. Take a bathroom break. Yep. Pack Grab a lunch. Some, some snacks and some beverages and take the bikes off and then we're just gonna go see what we can do. easier to do with the truck not attached. The other benefit of full-time RVing is you get to come here at times when there are no other people. It's empty so far. Granted, I don't know how busy this park is, but... Um, so, it's about two miles to each trailhead, so... We just need to go north, so this is like kind of a little... Is this a bike path? Rest stop, yeah. So you oh. take the bike path back out to kind of that main road. Oh. And that's where the trail is, so we'll pick that up and you ride for two miles and then we get to... Here, hold up. Did you see where it went? Way. So we should have gone the I'm opposite so way in the trail. We should have taken the left. Apparently. But didn't we say we were going north? I have no idea. That's what we both confirmed. Well, we both hypothesized. Well, I'm looking at the sun. The sun's up in the, in the west. But it's still only noon. So it's like, from this vantage point, we can't tell. I thought it was later. I say we go back. We started here. We 
we realized we were going south instead of north. So then we came back here, and now we're currently here. And now, we will go no further should than Should we go here. here? Absolutely not. It's a no for me, dog. We're gonna go right up that little dune, and we're gonna come right back. But we're gonna climb that. And we wanna see what's on the other side. I bet there's water. I know for sure there's a snack. Cool. You don't need a gym when you live on the west coast of Michigan. You just don't. You just come right to the dunes, climb a hill, good to go. Pretty cool view. Halfway up. Beautiful view. It's probably even better up there. It's a typer on the top of the hill. Oh man. It's just over that hill. Hey, we have to fight that. This is a decision time. What will we decide to do? Continue or turn back? Oh. I'm walking that bike, that's all I can do. Maybe the view is over that peak. Sure. Maybe. We've had two false horizons so far, two false summits. Yeah. Hopefully not three. The things you do for YouTube. Clip it here. It's too fat. Oh, fine. <sighs> I am losing momentum. Don't lose momentum. <laughs> Hopefully that was cool. I don't know what's going on. That better not be the third false summit. Hold on a second. Just a five, five sec. Man, that lake behind you is so cool. I can't look. I want to look at that lake. We're hoping it's Lake Michigan. Okay. Here we go. The final push. It all makes sense now. How like Karen Nate, you know, can eat donuts all the time. Oh. How people can eat yeah. what looks like junk food. Cause they're doing this kind of stuff all the time. It's a good trade off in my opinion. I'd rather do this every day. Me too. Eat donuts every day. Me too. I'm having fun. I don't look like it, but I'm having fun. She loves the challenge. I do. I just get a little whiny at this point in the <laughs> adventure. But we're so close. That's Please. What think. Here you go. Tell me if there's water, otherwise I'm sliding right back down. I'm not leaving you behind. Oh. We're crossing this peak together. Do it. Oh. Oh my. Oh, jeez. Oh. No. There's no. I can't. Oh. Maybe it's time we consult Google Maps, or maybe I just go up on that peak right there. 
Let me do some investigation. No! This is why you should research before you go hike. You never know what you're getting yourself into. It's worth it. So close. You got a great background. Who, me? It's you. I don't know what view I like better. Like Michigan? Or whatever like that is. That one? Or that one? Or that one? No brakes. Well, oh, it's pretty cool in here. There's no wind in here. Can't see the lakes. It's kind of cool. Maybe if I push it, you catch it. I'll push it. Okay. I can push it. Ready? <gasps> That's like a 10 second rule. That's really gross. What would he do? <laughs> he did it first. It was on the ground. How could you do that? Well, I don't know how many more I had to. I didn't really have to. One. I did the same thing. One of mine fell underneath. We don't waste peanut butter or what is that? What is scratch? Either. I think it was peanut butter. We Treats. don't we don't waste peanut butter in this house. Sugar. And the UV kills germs, so it's whatever. Yeah. Um so we're finishing up our snack here at the Dunes Climb in Sare wait, what is it? Sleeping Bear Dunes State. No, National. We should probably Lake get our Shore. locations. Correct? Yeah, we Before really we do. Start vlogging. We'll get better at this. We'll get better at this. We've gone six hundred miles in six days seven days so eight days forget us um so we got a bike a couple miles back to our our rig and then uh i think we're staying at a harvest host tonight just north of traverse city but i gotta call this person make sure we can get in we had a great experience last night at the harvest village the farm Amazing breakfast, home cooked country breakfast, omelet, fruit, yogurt, toast, jam. All right. So first thing you do is go to the app, brake controller. So you click okay. accept. accept. 
important reminder. Accept. Accept. It's going to load. Just select profile one. Um, now click a, uh, hit the brake. No, like the actual brake. So you can see it's activated, so you're connected. So that's good. So now you okay. can go out of here. Um, go back, go to, back the to the maps. So let's set. Now, next thing you do is notice that the brake is on. Yes. So just keep that in mind. You can turn it off if you want. Okay, and now put it in tow haul mode. Yep. Just press that. Yep. Okay. Now the turns, you gotta take them wide, but don't like overdo it. The truck's pretty good. Yeah. The trailer's not too big. Um, braking, you gotta brake way earlier. Right. And it's gonna be a slow drive. And acceleration, it's gonna be slow accelerations, which is totally fine. Slow and steady. Yeah. So oh, there's a car. Well, let's see where they're going. I'll have you go out, do a tight turn, and then come back around. You're gonna come out this way. Makes sense? Yeah, so in front of that red well, car. Well, if that car doesn't move, then. I could still go in front of that car. Because you want me to do like a figure eight almost. Yeah. I guess, yeah, head that way. So, what you're gonna wanna watch now is over here, you got a curb pretty close. So, you can't turn like super tight, otherwise, the trailer's back tires. Are gonna hit that curb. You're not you're not gonna be able to see the tires from here. I'll keep an eye on it for you, um, but just take a, a bit of a wider turn. Yep, you're totally good. Totally good. Yeah. So now I would go on our side of the red car and just do a loop around. When them. you say our side, so turn right here. Yep, you're good. You can turn harder. And then now go left around this lady and I would just don't even go on the road just go through here make yourself easier make your life easier yo lady you're making this challenging for me I think she's trying to make it easier for me yeah thanks lady so there you go how does she feel heavy no feels yeah but it feels good I'm the first time I ever drove it was in a church parking lot after we True. picked it up so the nice thing is it's not wider than the truck. So as long as you keep the truck right. in the lane, you're good. First time towing Gypsy, brake harder. Calm down, everybody. 